how to install Windows 11, super easy process and absolutely free. Hey guys, please make sure you watch the whole video and you will be able to install it by yourself. So let's do that. Open any of your favorite browser and type Windows 11 download. Once you have typed it into the search bar, hit enter. Now the very first result will come Microsoft.com download Windows 11. So I'll just click on that. And here you have three options. And guys, please do not worry. Even if you have a unsupported PC, if your PC doesn't support Windows 11, you still will be able to install Windows 11 in your computer. So no worries. So people who are sure that their computer is compatible with Windows 11, what they can do is Windows 11 installation assistant. They just need to download the assistant and a very small file will be downloaded. It's a 40 megabyte file and you just need to open it and it will ask you to say yes. Follow the instruction and you just need to click on next few times and you will be able to install Windows 11 yourself. And people who are using unsupported PC and want to install Windows 11, what they can do is they can open up the browser and type Rufus. And guys, we need a USB drive to install Windows 11. That's the easiest process to install Windows 11 on unsupported PC. So I have typed Rufus and I have got the result Rufus.ie. So you just need to click on that and a window will appear like this. I just need to scroll down and from the download section, we need to install the latest version of Rufus 3.18. I'll click on that and a very small file will be downloaded, almost a one megabyte file. Plug in your USB. Please make sure that you have plugged in your USB and it should not have anything on it. It should be blank. And I'll just click on open file, the Rufus. It will ask you to say yes. And here we go. We have a new window of Rufus. And here we need to select the USB drive, the flash drive. I can see it is 32 GB. It doesn't have anything in it because if you have anything on that pen drive, that will be wiped out. So from here, the boot selection is disk or ISO image. You don't have to make any changes. And you need to download the Windows 11 ISO from here. So the very first option was assistant. And below here, download Windows 11 disk image. So select Windows 11 multi edition and click on download. And then you will find an option, select the product language. From here, you can select the language English United States or any other language and then click on confirm and the ISO file will be downloaded. Now, once it is done here, come back here select the disk the iso which we have just downloaded in my case i have saved it in my documents under iso i'll select windows 11 and i'll click on open now once this is done from here image option we need to select standard windows 11 extended one no tpm no secure boot once you select it select the partition scheme whether you're using mbr or GPT and you don't have to make any changes you just need to click on start once the ISO image is created in the USB flash drive you can plug in that restart the computer and it will ask you to select press any key to install Windows 11 and you will be able to install it on unsupported PC as well please let me know if you have successfully installed Windows 11 in your computer if yes, please hit the like and subscribe. Also leave a comment which version of Windows you're using. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Have a wonderful day.